With this unprecedented situation emerging through the epidemic, humans throughout the planet have seen a change in their lifestyles like never before. When we look at world history, we have seen epidemics and pandemics of massive nature hit the world before this as well. But the kind of control which has been imposed for curtail of damage is most certainly unprecedented. Back then there was a significant lack of information on real-time basis due to less or no media availability. Governments throughout the world have taken some very tough decisions of having to lock down everything almost globally. Everyone has to stay home to beat the epidemic whether they like it or not. But interestingly this has a surprising effect on animals. With people maintaining social distancing, the skies are significantly clearer and enormous fall in the level of sound and air pollution. Tranquility in shores is probably what these beautiful animals needed, who share the world with us large-heartedly. But don't think it's all glamour. Some animals have had to face a lot of difficulty surviving due to the unforeseen circumstances. In today's video we will uncover to you 10 unbelievable effects of the epidemic lockdown on animals. Watch this video till the end because the last point may just surprise you. Welcome to WatchTop10.com. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that you can stay updated with our latest videos. Number 10. Dolphins have returned to ports. Italy has been one of the worst struck countries. With around 15,000 people dead, it's witnessing one of the most tragic times in history. But nature has its ways. The absence of ships in Italy have encouraged dolphins to return in huge numbers to the port of Cagliari. Not just that, you will also see all over the internet, viral videos and pictures of Venice canals and swans. Maybe this is a sign that nature heals itself when a massive number of humans are not around. Amazingly, due to less boat traffic in Venice, which brings sediment on top of water surface, more creatures are now being attracted to the waters than usual. Fish and swans are spotted paddling and swimming around which is very unusual for Venice. Number 9. Nara deer showing up in Japan. Japan's Nara Park is normally big on tourists. Thanks to the attractions and its 1,000 powerful herd of Sika deer. All year round holiday goers flock to the deer and try to feed them with rice cakes and take selfies with them. They are not ordinary, instead they are an extremely intelligent breed of deer, some of which have even learned how to bow on command of tourists. But just like almost all other countries, Japan too has restricted traveling. Which leaves us with two significant impacts on these unique species of deer. Firstly the deer are now deprived of food due to lack of travelers who used to find pleasure in feeding them. Secondly Sika deer are now venturing outside the park. Be it on the hunt for food, or just gallivanting, since there aren't many humans around. They're just happily exploring. And guess what? Sika deer have never been seen out of their habitat before this. Good that we are finally sharing our planet nicely with other species as well. Number 8. Jaguars are exploring resorts in Mexico. Yes, that definitely is quite a shocker. This is exactly what's happening in Mexico. Recently there have been videos and pictures circulating over the internet of jaguars roaming on deserted tourist locations in Mexico. According to the media, this wandering jaguar was also spotted inside the complex of a famous resort and spa. Very seldom do jaguars attack humans, but they most certainly do if they feel threatened by them. So if you do end up coming across one, just make sure to walk away and do your own thing. If for some reason, you decide to initiate a friendship with the jaguar, make sure to reconsider your decision. Because in the niceness of your heart, you might be extending friendship, but they are not humans remember that. For them to understand you, might not be very easy. So don't end up intimidating them instead. Number 7. Huge monkey gangs are out and about in Thailand. Thailand, as you know is a tourist destination with millions of people visiting it each year. Monkeys in Thailand exist in very large volumes as you may already know. Most tourists make sure to go see them and feed them with a banana or something suitable. These monkeys almost never went hungry as they relied on the abundance of tourist food, which they got almost all year round. However, that's not quite the case anymore. Amid the present situation, a large number of monkeys have been seen brawling over a yogurt pot in a street in Thailand. There's a video which was made in the city of Laburi showing the crazy brawl. Laburi is in the northeast of Bangkok, and it is famous for its monkey population. The monkeys are known for roaming the streets and stealing food from nearby residents. Well monkey fights are not unusual, but a brawl of this size has never been seen in Thailand before. Each monkey troop had at least 500 monkey members. 
This most certainly is unfortunate, and we hope that the government takes effective measures to stabilize food supplies for animals in Thailand. Number 6. Pumas Exploring Santiago's. Within a one-week period, Chilean authorities have captured their second cougar on Wednesday. Well, the cat was conveniently strolling through an elite suburb of Santiago, maybe encouraged by the quiet evening. There's a nighttime curfew due to the pandemic situation and the prevailing lockdown. Which further encourages these pumas to come around in the quite human-less streets for now. Well, this cougar was a 22-kilogram female. The male puma caught before this one and sent to the zoo, weighed 30 kilograms, and was happily climbing people's walls before being caught. Experts say, when the nasty drought came in the dusty foothills around Santiago. Back then as well, it brought the cats out, hungry for food to the streets of the city. Hence the barren streets are once again inviting them. Thankfully people around and the pumas were both unharmed. Before we move on, don't forget to watch our other amazing videos mentioned in the description below, or by clicking on the link above. Number 5. Good news for hedgehogs. It is pretty complicated to understand how our presence affects wildlife. The changes to come after this whole situation settles down might be slightly hard to predict. But certain things are anticipated. So of course it's no news that in the UK, hedgehogs are an extremely popular mammal, but unfortunately their numbers have been drastically shrinking over the years. There are multiple reasons why this is happening, but one of the most prominent reasons of them dying is being hit by vehicles on the road. Given the present situation and most people not leaving their houses, and the fact that they are only allowed to make unavoidable journeys, there is evidently lesser traffic on the roads. Thereby our spiny friends have just resurfaced from hibernation and are safely exploring cities. For sure, they must be grateful for the peace and silence they get to enjoy on the roads. Number 4. Herd of goats have taken over Landidno. Landidno, which happens to be a tiny coastal town in North Wales, has just had a rather funny encounter. For all those who were missing some fun, well, now the fun is at your doorstep. Landidno has found a new definition to the phrase, herd immunity. As wild goats have been spotted roaming its streets, exploring the neighborhoods and enjoying their little vacation. This incident arrived just a few days after the British Prime Minister announced more restrictions on the movement of people in an effort to keep everyone safe. People living in this small town spotted herds of goats roaming around Landidno, not just on Friday but also on the weekend. Which goes out to show, it wasn't just once. These beautiful mountain goats are not usual, they're of a special kind, and they are called the Great Orm Kashmiri goats, which takes its lineage from northern India. Number 3. A coyote roaming freely in San Francisco. A coyote, the wolf-like predators was spotted in the city of San Francisco and the wider Bay Area from time to time. This predator has grown bolder and is out looking for food, as fewer people are found on the streets of the city. Since the shelter-in-place restrictions have been enacted in America, reported sightings in the city center have exploded. A CCTV camera captured footage of a hungry coyote stalking a couple walking with their dog at night. And other residents of San Francisco city have been shocked to witness packs of the canines, who were sleeping in broad daylight in usually busy residential areas, which is very unusual for these animals, cause they usually sleep in thick forests. This pandemic has shown us things which we never witnessed before and might not witness in our upcoming life. Number 2. Sea gulls in Yorkshire. So there has been a clear warning put forward to the people of Yorkshire by the authorities about the chances of sea gulls becoming even more aggressive. The decline in food supplies considering the present situation being the main reason. It's no news that when they are hungry, sea gulls just like other humans or animals can get very aggressive and warnings have been established to be cautious about this. To the extent that residents have been advised to avoid eating on seafronts so that the birds can find food somewhere far away from towns. But if people continue eating on seafronts, they'll witness that food sources are available in towns and they'll hungrily and aggressive go after the eaters from there, endangering human life. Their behavior is becoming increasingly concerning with the passage of time. Recently, there were claims of seagulls attacking babies for some horrible reason. Number 1. Black swans are thriving. The popular black swans of Dawlish are believed to be going strong and truly enjoying the tranquility and silence. Ever since the swans were reduced to just one breeding pair in the entire world, they have been fighting for survival. Although there has a horrific chain of dog attacks on them in the recent storms. However, given the present situation, with most people having to stay home and lesser traffic on the roads, 
There are also changes amongst animals and their choices of residing. Some have ventured into the cities on abandoned roads, while others are exploring non-human places to try out and live. Hence, swans too are mostly left alone, while other threatening animals for them, like dogs, are busy vacationing. Recently, there have been viral videos of a black swan standing comfortably on just one leg near dollish water and enjoying the charming sunshine. For some animals this unusual situation has proved to be excellent, whereas for others it has been rather unfortunate, as many animals go hungry and uncared for. In these trying times, we must not forget these innocent animals who need food to survive. Make sure to always leave something outside your house for wandering cats and dogs to eat. Given the circumstances, we won't be surprised if you have some very unusual animals visiting you in your garden. So make sure to keep yourself extremely safe and secure. Sending the kids out to play is also not a very wise decision at this point. Because when these unique animals can find their way into car parks and hotels, your backyard shouldn't be much of a problem. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe.